Now, the 21st show of Ogbomosho land, Gandhi Olawi, has officially been installed. Governor Shei Makinde made the pronouncement while presenting staff of office to the new monarch. Olaido Iwale has more in this report. In an atmosphere that resonates every sense of cultural pride and unity, the official handing over of the staff of office to the 21st Shonwo of Ogbomosho took place in the historic town. Again, history came alive as the Shonwo Township Stadium welcomed eminent personalities, including traditional rulers, political figures, as well as sons and daughters of the ancient town. The traditional ruler gracefully accepted his staff of office from Governor Makinde, pledging to uphold the values of the traditional institution in harmony with his vision for the town's future. Let my coronation, let it be a celebration of a collective reaffirmation of our shared destiny. I intend to be a king to serve, irrespective of religion, irrespective of the gender, and irrespective of other things that might differentiate us. The governor in his congratulatory message advised those who contested the stool with the king to set aside their differences and unite in supporting the new monarch. The contestation for the throne is behind us. And I'm looking forward to our Tiwanshi Wani court withdrawing the court cases by maybe end of this week as a show of love for Ogbomosho land. He must unite every segment of the Ogbomosho land, Christians, Muslims, traditionalists, elites, the young people. You know the beauty? The beauty about our king is that he's a preacher, he's a pastor. So what will you tell a pastor that knows the in and out of the Bible? I pray to God Almighty, his experience to guide him. With the call for unity echoing through the sons and daughters of Ogumosho land, once again, the historic town embarks on another leadership journey under Oba Gandhi Olaoyi, and they look forward for a greater future. Olaide Oyewole, TVC News, Ogumosho.